Quick, name 15 things you know about India. Go. 15 things, 15 know things about that India? you know about India. It's a continent. No, it's actually on Asia. Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions, the idiots on Corbin. As with me, as always, is this idiot named Ricardo. to our channel, go ahead and smash the like button, subscribe, and ring that little bell to be part of the notification squad. <gasps> also, please follow us on our various social media platforms, Instagram, Twitter, for more juicy content. Anyways, <laughs> so today... We'll be reacting to a very requested video. 15 things that you did not know about India. I didn't know there were 15 things I didn't know about India. I don't know anything about India. Yes, you um, do. Outside of the fact that you guys Asia. have wonderful cinematography. Yes, great food. Uh, great food. Yep. Um, I, obviously, you know about the story about Mahatma Gandhi and the whole liberation from the um, British Empire. I know that there was a badass queen, Manakarnika. Oh, yeah. She was chopping people's heads off with was, her bare hands. It was awesome. Yep. So... Let's just get into it. Fifteen things you didn't know about India. Hmm. Welcome to Alux.com, the place where future billionaires come to get inspired. Us. Future billionaires. It's true. Hello, Aluxers, and welcome back to another fascinating video. Mm. Today we're looking at incredible facts you didn't know about the seventh largest country in the world. India. With a population of over a billion people, Knew that. India is one of the most influential and powerful countries in the world. Knew that. Its cultural history is particularly complex and detailed, spanning 4,500 years of predominantly Hindu philosophy and theology. Knew that. Thousands of years later, modern India is profoundly different, with its own colossal film industry, a diverse population, and an astonishingly big workforce. Because Alux.com is dedicated to becoming the world's best resource on the most interesting countries and destinations, we couldn't wait to bring you 15 things you didn't know about India. All right, India. cut to the well, chase, then lady. Then bring them to Good us. Good grief. Hollywood. Number one. That's Bollywood. Hollywood's highest grossing film Do they really have a sign like that? times no, more that's than Hollywood. Ours. Well, I know it's clearly ours. I know there's a satellite. For every 600 films Hollywood produces, Bollywood will make 1,000. Oh, God. They're the most profitable films, too, when you compare the numbers. Yeah. Hollywood's highest grossing film was 2009's Avatar, Blue which Blue made $2.8 million dollars at the box office. In stark contrast, the Bollywood film Three Idiots brought in $76.81 billion. Great now, title. In fact, I've seen some requests for Three Idiots. That's what we're reacting to next. Number oh! Juicy <laughs> content. in the 16th century India. What? Derived shampoo? Sanskrit shampoo. Invented? Massage. They gave us the shampoo. concept of it shampooing was, was invented in India in the 16th century. You guys are Herbs so awesome. And natural ingredients Thank you. Were used Nobody has nanky ass hair. Thanks to you. Thanks to you. Chemicals and fragrances. In particular, gooseberry. Mm. Gooseberry. I love missing gooseberries. Mm, I when like it on the salad. came to India, <laughs> they brought the practice of shampooing and hair washing back with them to Europe. Because mm. prior to that, they were slobs. Number three. Diamonds were first mined in India, and it was the world's greatest producer. Interesting. India was the most productive diamond mining country in the world until diamonds were found in Brazil in the 18th century. Mm -hmm. There are now three active diamond mines in India, and the famous Kohinoor diamond was found in but the 13th century. You don't the have blood diamond. The 793 carat stone went from person to person <sighs> and was eventually acquired by Queen Victoria of course. during the British Raj in India. The Brits taking everything. <gasps> oh. Number four, elephants in Kerala can treat themselves to a spa. Oh, day. that's, that's awesome! The Orkata Elephant Yard Rejuvenation Center provides elephants with baths, massages, awesome. and soothing pamper sessions. See, the spa caters to. That's what I want to hear about. Clients, I don't want to hear about the morons killing them. Back to the sacred. Animal. I want to know that this kind of stuff's elephants happening and that people killing them are getting killed. Can I visit India and, and do this? I want. No, I would love to so do that. That would be awesome. Give them a bath and a massage. Number five, the largest religious gathering in India can be seen from space. Wow. Kumbh Mela is Dang. a Hindu pilgrimage which takes people to the banks of the Ganges every 12 years. The major event involves ritualistic bathing, devotional singing, religious That's discussion, amen. and feeding the poor. The attendance figures had yeah, to be were. capped at 75 million, Rock and making roll. it the largest pilgrimage on earth. 
<laughs> Hippies ain't getting nothing on the Indians. Number six. Ancient Indian civilization is the oldest in the world. Say what? We often look to ancient Greece and ancient Egypt. Egypt. But Indian civilization dates back to 2400 BC, when it was split into 16 monarchies known as the Mahajanapadas. There are even authentic human remains that date back to 20,000 years in South Asia. The oldest Hindu texts were written between 2000 and 500 On a guy's head. Right there, they're writing the ancient texts. The next oldest is America. We actually owe the number zero to India mathematics who created the concept. Number seven. India is home to every major world religion and doesn't have a national language. Really? I didn't know that. Christianity, Buddhism, Islam, Doesn't and America Sikhism. have that too? All have yeah, but you don't have Scientology like we do here in Hollywood. <laughs> yes, there's a new Covering 80% and 14% of the population, respectively. Judaism has existed in India for the last 2,215 years, and some of these smaller religions also featured, including Jain, Zoroastrian, and Baha'i. India also doesn't have a single national language because 1,652 dialects are spoken across the different regions. I've read that in the comment section. Dang! Number eight. A polling station is set up for just one voter in Gear Forest at every election. Every election, Marant Barandas de Shandas gets his local polling station entirely to himself. That's awesome. He's That's the president right. of Gear Forest. Yes. He's been voting in Indian elections since 2004 and never misses one now that he has his own personal polling station. Mahant is the caretaker of one personal temple in the forest in Gujarat, a home he shares with the rare Asiatic lion. That's cool. Yeah. Number nine. The Indian government has used scaffolding to hide the Taj Mahal when airstrikes are predicted. Okay. During the Second World War and the Indian-Pakistan Wars, scaffolding was put up around the distinctive domes of the Taj Mahal so people wouldn't to blow make it, it less obvious from above. To they make it less visible and obvious. The Japanese Air Force during World War II. There's this thing called so longitude and latitude. Number. More well, this recent was World threats War II. to the Taj Mahal. They knew about the longitude and latitude of the Yamuna River, yeah. which yeah. has cracked the tomb underneath the structure. There have been predictions that the tombs could collapse at any time. <gasps> Ooh, Check out our video, 15 Most Expensive Man Made Attractions in the World, to find out what ranks along the, the Taj, Taj Mahal. I do too. I really do. We should go and make a vlog. Number 10. Bucket list. Indians invented navigation, <gasps> yoga, More yoga, the world's cheapest car, what? and thorium based nuclear power. You know, we were talking about Indian thorium based nuclear power just, just, just the other day. Indian it's true. Uh, popped up in a conversation. They were the first yeah. to create the concept India, of navigation online, yeah. over 6,000 years While ago. While we were doing yoga using rivers in the and world's seas. cheapest car. Yoga was created 5,000 years ago and has roots in Hinduism, Buddhism, and Jainism. The world's cheapest car, the Tata Nano, which costs around 100,000 rupees, the equivalent of $1,400. Dang. And India is the Sell them here. The yeah, I want one. I need one of those. Thorium reactor. <laughs> the country is aiming to produce 30% of its electrical power with thorium by 2050. Isn't that... You guys. That's awesome. That came from, like, uh, Captain America, didn't it? Thorium? You can stay at the former Indian royal residence for $88,000 a night. Nice. If you We're there. Can we stay two nights? I'm going to get the phone. Can we, can we stay two nights? Forget Dubai. India is the home of the most stunning palaces in the world. Once the home of the Maharajas, there are opulent palaces throughout the country, with some dating back hundreds of years. Yeah, I'd like the former the Indian Maribel royal residence, please. This is Prince a great Charles's day. 65th Shut birthday, up. and the 450-year-old Samod Palace in Jaipur has hosted famous faces from all over the world. Number 12. It was a thorium King factory. King Jai Singh of Alwar snubbed Rolls Royce in the best possible way. India has a long and colorful history of quirky monarchies and extravagant kings and queens. The king of Alwar in northeast India was insulted by a Rolls Royce salesman when he visited a showroom in London. A very proud man, he ordered a whole fleet of Rolls Royce cars and gave them to the city's waste department so they could use them to transport rubbish. <laughs> One million Indians are millionaires. India has one of the most dramatic wealth gaps in the world. If you'd like to support us, set up our, we just set up our Patreon. Yeah, come on. <laughs> <You're laughs> <in the fun. laughs> yeah. I can't do that as well with my left hand. The uh, richest yeah, Indian yeah, in the world yeah. is Mukesh Ambani, who has a net worth of $53 billion. Well, the who doesn't? Made his money Can I have a million of that? And his billion-dollar <laughs> really? home recently made headlines dang, because dang. he chose to build a 27-story skyscraper instead of a sprawling mansion. 
27 stories. Number 14. The first account of plastic surgery was found in an ancient Sanskrit text. One of the first medical texts was the Sushruta Samhita, which can be dated back to the 6th century CE. It's one of the very first examples of a medical text and discusses surgery, incisions, skin grafts, and nose reconstruction. Mm. Britain's first nose job wouldn't be performed until 1814, a worrying 80 years before the Sushruta Samhita would be translated. Dang. Number 15. One of India's most extravagant weddings caused controversy because it was too extravagant. Lasting five days and costing $74 million, the wedding of the daughter of a prominent businessman made headlines in 2016 for all the wrong reasons. The $2.5 million wedding sari, Bollywood royalty Dang. in attendance, and gold Bangalore Palace setting was denounced as an obscene display of wealth. Millions of Indians live in poverty, so the wedding was criticized for being in poor taste. Dad? There are many stereotypical images of India, but there's so much more to this incredible country than many of us know. The center of many industries and the world's biggest democracy, oh, India has influenced art, Cricket. literature, yeah. science, and medicine potentially more than any other nation. If you could take a trip to this beautiful, fascinating country, where would you find yourself? In India. In a yeah. gorgeous Maharaja's Duh. palace, surrounded by palm trees and rural countryside, or a modern apartment in the thick of busy Mumbai? I'd find myself in a thorium nuclear plant driving the smallest car in the world while I do yoga. I would um, bathe an elephant. Yeah, I would want to bathe an elephant. That's awesome. That's that's. That would... That's fantastic. That's cool. That's really I, cool. That I mean, this video was actually pretty cool. I mean, the most of it, I didn't know the majority of that I didn't know any of this stuff. So yep. it, very cool. It came through on what yeah, uh, that Jim McCabe was supposed to it do. Did good job, video people. <laughs> Please let us know what other stuff we don't know. Because we want to try the food. Idiots. Yes, well, there uh, we are trying to um, set up a video to where we try different Indian snacks, yep. foods, yep. Other things of that nature. So yep. if you have any recommendations, let us know down in the comment section below. Especially if it's spicy. Corbin loves spicy. He can't handle spice. He's a wimp when it comes to spice. No. Yeah.